Hi boys, we're going to game 2 between both of the team. It is very interesting game between Burst the Sky versus Define Esport on the game 2. Will the Define Esport gonna win the match and we will going to game 3 or team BTS gonna gonna be a Korean pop? <laughs> <laughs> it's different from BTS, okay? Mm, I think Team BTS gonna win the match and it is gonna be a very rough game, game for them. Okay, on the mid lane, we have our real versus one hero, but champion there. On the top lane, the red buff, they try to contest it. Our real try to make a move. They're very aggressive, man. Seriously. They try to get the red buff, but they know it is a bad time for them to get it and just move back and make a bit trade hit there. And the bottom lane, ooh, Akali versus Oriana. It is very interesting match for me because both of them normally use on the mid lane, but right now, ooh, Akali, no, Kaisa coming to help me. And then, yeah, there's Oriana just move away. And on the mid lane, our Yale versus as far as I know, this champion is naming Oriana, right? And on the top lane, I think Corky have a good time here because Akali can do nothing about it. Ooh, Kaisa man. Fiora on this bottom lane have very bad time for him. Try to make a move on the middle of the tower. Akali can survive, try to make fake back, but to a lot of creep there. It's very dangerous for uh, Akali to make a fight. Yeah, for main rotation for from team BTS and they can get the top lane. Our oh, coming to help. He try to stun on Jarvis on the bottom, try to get the Fiora, but no, Fiora is too low. He have a flash, but double kill on the top lane. Our Gael make a very impressive move, try to get a kill, Akali as well, no, but he can survive. Oriana on the top lane, get very big damage by Akali, and yeah, just move away. That's mean team Define is part gonna get the bottom lane. It is very easy for them. And that, I don't know why, but on Vietnam, they so love Jarvis. Before this game, on the game 1, they try to win Jarvis. And right now, they pick it. That means they love Jarvis. Uh, for Kaisa and Lulu, this same in every region because the most offer power champion I know on ADC is Kaisa in his version. And I'm not, I, uh, I'm not surprised if both of the champion is picking or banning right now. Again, Akali <laughs> try to defend the hardest part of the on the map on the bottom lane because on the top lane this is far people try to get a car key but no Jarvan make a very aggressive move. I mean it's very best a good move by Jarvan and Rakan's just dying on the bottom lane. It just disappear. No, Akali coming. Wukong try to make a counter and easy get, but he is too sick, man. It's too hard to kill that Wukong and easy kill on the bottom lane. Jarvan down on the top lane. Try to make a move again. Fiora coming with helping, but no, Rakan is very good move. Try to get the uh, Nami, but he uses his ulti. Just move away. Try to get the Kaisa as well. He make a damage, but Kaisa cannot do nothing about this Ariana. Next Tanya. Ooh. ooh. <laughs> on this offlane Ariel make a very impressive. Seriously. I love how this Ariel playing. She can death on the top lane. Far people top. Normally you will just leave it the, the lane. Ooh, look at this. Look at this match man. Kaisa try to kill her damage. Use his ulti and just move away. But no. Nami use his ulti and try to get on the bot lane. Kaisa lose damage and dying by Oriana. But Ariel make a very impressive move. He can make a deal damage and punish the movement of Kaisa. It's very aggressive though. And not Kaisa. Kaisa is his friend. I mean uh, Fiora. Okay, we got the dragon here. 
team define make a good opportunity they can get the dragon next move we try to get the back lane Meanwhile, Ariel make a very impressive move, try to get the car key, 3 months stun on the but on the back line I mean, ooh, no, Nami almost get one there, use his ult and no one dying for both of the team. At least Team Divine have the dragon, it is very good for them, it's a very big objective. They try to get the bottom as well, no one there, it is free tower for them. Jarvan? He hit me to, to, to retreat Nami try to give information about position of team BTS meanwhile Ariel coming with his stun but no someone cancel it this this Ariana on the top but the target is too low I think it's free for them for team define I just recall away Akali make a very impressive move on the top they make team bts spirit okay oh no akali try to fight back two people there he make very big damage try to run he have smoke though he have smoke but no he cannot use it he is in the last second but no fear i got it akari much down on the top lane his friend is coming to help but now the one there oh rakan <laughs> it's a bad bad champion akali oh it's low man burst down is so big for that's ariana from that's ariana i mean try to get it but no it's too far away nami now try to make a recall and the uh, air air edge or reef herald is free for timber bts define kaisa is far away as well as that akali i think it is three versus far there Jarvan try to in get it no who can get the hero try to make initiate get one kill there try to run by Rakan and Aurel try to catch it on the bat in the back side Nami he can survive but no Akali coming to help Kaisa as well get the double kill from Koki on the top lane Aurel can win the duel and for team down to team BTS wow what a move by both of the team and this okay try to inside of the tower but no it's too big away Ooh, the damage too big seriously yeah but at least they got far kill and no dragon no 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 hero i think the um, bts got the hero as far as i know that's wukong got it right and oriana on the bottom side try to split push as always because yeah the meta is right now is split pushing trailer line pushing is better than just one right that's why uh on the last match on the last tournament i saw someone use that and camille and both of them just split pushing and the rest of the team just try to make a move between top and bottom especially uh, uh, mostly they spend time on the mid mostly but not all, all of the time just mostly you get my point okay if you're on the bottom lane Ariel try to make a move just away but no Jarvan try to get him but he cannot damage kill move away Jarvan try to fight back but no three men get get up gain but no full up damage knock for a team burst bts wukong down as well kaisa try to make a move no try to get nami he can't kill it but he can't to survive cannot to survive okay at least kaisa get the kill or kaisa get the burst damage and five men down by team bts it is very good for team define dragon and spawn as well they can get it if they want it because right now they low on health they lose on the number it is very hard for them to get the dragon if team burst bts try to contest okay but no okay he can steal it no he can no one can steal it dragon down team divine can uh saving that dragon and that's make a very impressive okay he tried to get the ariel but that's make him dying because yeah that is disparate move by that ariana nothing he can do the bridge down from case is too too hard for real seriously for real 
Because right now guys, I have a lot of damage. I mean a lot of item and network as well. Actually, just get information about where TM BTS the even try to get the Baron <laughs> at 10 minutes. Wow, it's gonna be very interesting for Divine. They have good opportunity. Have 10 10 K network as well. Rakan try to stun, but no. Jarvan get the Baron. Backline try to get Akali is very nice move. Try to get as well. Your Francis Fiora on the top lane, but no, guys. I'll make very big damage. He's gonna three men, a uh, two men die by Team Bird is spot. Fiora, the last man standing on the top. Try to get it. That's away, but no damage uh, coming from Thing Define. He can move between the tower. What a move by Fiora. He also have the jump. Okay, he's saving. I think he's safe. But not with his uh, turrets on the mid lane. Akali keep searching him. No, yeah, Fiora survive. survive more. <laughs> that is that is interesting because uh, two people on the top try to get it without any stun. Fiora cannot to get kill. Okay, he got the red buff for cocky, I think. For cocky, for sure, for cocky. And on the bottom lane, Wukong and Fiora. Just try to clean. Oh, it's very big explosion. In here, they okay. Three men stun, but you looks that Akali man. He just move away from the war. Kaisa as well on the inside of the tower. Akali move again. Team BDS have a trouble. Kaisa and Akali make a lot of damage, and they got punished. Two people down on the Baron side war, and. It is good of good opportunity for team defined. Oh Rakan initiate to Kaisa the damage. Oh no, damage not now. Wukong gonna be the victim here. Oh, he tried to run. He have a guardian angel, but guardian angel gonna save his life. No, no one can save you, man. Wukong gonna die. Jarvan is very a uh, cocky right now try to make a move Fiora get it and backline oh Akali so low try to kill and he got the Fiora it's very bad for them BTS oh Kaisa man he not hit the the crystal he's dying by crystal Jarvan try to make a move it's very low no he's down with his guardian angel and Corky coming with his kill kill the Jarvan fight back by uh, by Akali and he can survive the only one survive on the top war is Akali The guy is very greedy though seriously He tried to hit the Ariana, but that is too far away I think I mean he need to, to focus on the crystal if that Kaisa Kill the crystal or hit the crystal. I think yeah, this game is end they don't need to Thinking again or make it more long for them Seriously, if that Kaisa hit the crystal, this game is end. For sure, I'm sure about it. He have he have time and he have a damage. Five man rotation on the mid lane maybe to the dragon side. Ariel on the bottom. Try to get it. Maybe Rakan try to nice it, but no vision. They have vision. Both of them have vision. Try to get the dragon oh, very fast. The dragon, oh no, if you're around the top, that means it is free dragon for team define. Where is you, man? You cannot escape. Ariel coming with his stun, got him one, done. and Ariel is very have impact there. He's down, but rest of the team make a very good move. They got three kill with the burn spawn, and yeah. First of the team just get the Baron, but no, team BTS try to contest it. Yeah, he's coming. Nami stand on one. He champion on the backside. Try to zoning them. Kaisa make a very big impact. Okay, Fiora is survive right now. That is not for long. Okay, he survived. Almost get burst down by Kaisa, but he make a very good dash timing. And yeah, the team define just need to fight back. It just just need to back and help make your helpful buying item. And the next next war, I'm for sure. Team define gonna be a very very sick.
they will have a very good time for winning the war and team BTS need to get the Kai'Sa at least because the the burst damage from team burst damage is not on the time on the top lane when you look uh, Rakan initiate on the Kai'Sa you can count the damage man they need more on the damage they need coming as one not like that on the bottom side okay two men stun again by Rakan but no wall up damage again Rakan okay Rakan is down one man down by team BTS try to make a fight back but can do nothing about it Kaisa on the front lane alone versus three people but he can survive and yeah Akali make a very good decision Kaisa just know about the kill but Akali I love you Akali because you make this game and it's so fast this sure win by team define and it's a call guys thanks for watching team define winning the game 2 0 on 2 or 2 and they will move to the next stage i keep on my channel i will always back up a little bit reef game and dota right now i hope i have time to make opportunity or improve to my channel so just support my channel as fast as possible i will to improve it uh, fast cam as well and the other stuff uh, uh some some stuff like that okay thanks for watching see you on the next time no name here and yeah game to between them it is okay for you if you subscribe i love it <laughs> i start to myself bye thanks for watching bye bye